hello guys welcome to my channel today in this video i'm going to show you how to fix this error that is load failed error is 2ffdf851 failed to load player profile do you want to retry so if you're receiving this error message with ea sports wrc game on your windows computer then please follow the steps shown in this video now the first step is to make sure your windows username does not have any special character so if your username has special character like this or any kind of special character this is these are just an example so it may be different special character so if you have if your windows username has a special character then you might face this problem so when you go to users over here you can see your username so if your username have any kind of special character then that's the reason you're facing the problem so in this case you can create a new windows user account and admin account so for this open windows settings the steps are same for windows 10 and windows 11 users go to accounts and then scroll down and then click on other users now over here i have created multiple test accounts so let me remove this so once you go to accounts and and then when you scroll down click on other users now click on add account and then over here if you have any other microsoft account you can use it if you don't have a microsoft account then click on i don't have this person's sign in information click on it and then you can create a new user account so create an account over here this is just an example so you can create your username make sure that you do not put any special character over here like inverted commas slash or hash do not put anything just keep it simple so create a user account without any special character and then if you want to use a password so you can enter a password over here create a new password now answer your security question so you can select your security questions and then answer it this is just an example so you can select your security question and answer your security questions and then click on next and once the account is created click on this drop down arrow and then click on change account type and then for from standard users click on this down arrow select administrator and then click on ok now once the account is created now you can go to click on your user account over here in the start menu and then over here you will see newly a created account so you can click on this and then you can enter your pin or password now once you enter the password login and then you can launch the game and you should not receive this error error message so this has worked for many players if you have to reinstall the game you can reinstall the game and then you can launch the game and you should not receive this error message this has worked for many players so try this still you're facing the problem in in that case if you have onedrive or google drive open then make sure that you close onedrive or google drive so if you have onedrive open you will see onedrive over here click on this up arrow if you see it over here you can make a right click and quit it if you don't see it you can click on this up arrow and in hidden uh, over here you will see your onedrive icon so make a right click on onedrive icon and then click on quit onedrive and make sure onedrive is closed when you launch the game also if you have google drive you can close the google drive now the next step is to allow the game exe file to your antivirus program so if you have any third party antivirus just make sure that you allow the game exe file to your antivirus like if you have a vast norton mcafee bit defender whichever antivirus program you have allow the game exe file to your antivirus program now if you have if you are using windows security then open windows settings and then go to privacy and security if you have windows 11 and then click on windows security if you have windows 10 you will see an option update and security click on update and security then click on windows security now scroll down click on virus click on virus and threat protection and then scroll down and then you will see manage ransomware protection click on it now click on allow an app through controlled folder access click on yes to allow now click on add an allowed app now click on browse all apps now go to the game installation folder so if the game is installed in c drive open c drive if the game is installed in steam then you can open the program files x86 open the steam folder open the steam apps folder now open the common folder and then you will see over here the 
WRC folder. In my case, I have the game in EA app. I don't have the game on Steam. So I have the game on C drive in EA app. So I will open program files and then open EA games. Now open EA Sports WRC. Open the WRC folder. Binaries Win64. Select this exe file. Now click on open. Once it is added, again click on browse all apps and then select the second exe file. Now click on open. Once the game is added over here, now type in control panel in Windows search box and then click on control panel. And then click on system and security, Windows Defender Firewall. Click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. Click on change, search, change settings on the top and then click on allow another app. Click on browse. Again, go to the game installation folder, select the game exe file, click on open, click on add. In my case, I have already added. Again, click on allow another app, click on browse and select the second exe file. Now click on open, then click on add. In my case, both the files are added. Now, now once, once the game is added over here. So once you have the game added over here. Uh, yeah, once you have the game added over here, now you can click on OK. And then you can launch the game and you should not receive the error message. And still you are receiving the error message. The last step is to repair or verify the game file. So if you have the game on EA app, go to EA app, click on manage and then click on repair. After the repair, you can launch the game. If you have the game on Steam, you can go to Steam, make a right click on the game. I don't have the game on Steam. I'm showing you with different game. This is just an example. So make a right click on WRC game and then select properties, go to install files and then click on verify integrity of game files. After the verification, launch the game. So one of the steps shown in this video should help you to fix this error. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.